Shavuos, the holiday of Shavuos, is called Mo, is one of the Moadei Hashem, one of the special uh, times of the year where we get together with the Rebbeinu Shalom in a special way. Well, we get together every day, but in a special way. So the first day of Shavuos, both in Eretz Yisrael and in Chutz Laaretz, we make a special effort to learn at night, to learn Torah at night. That's the day of Matan Torah, etc. But also, in Chutz Laaretz, the second day of Shavuos is also Moadei Hashem. And how could it be Moadei Hashem if you just eat and drink and, uh, and uh, you know, enjoy yourself? There's got to be some element of Talmud Torah on that day as, uh, as well. So it's important on the second day in Chutz Laaretz, uh, which is Shavuos, Yom Tov Sheni, uh, to make sure that we don't, uh, we don't come out of Matan Torah and say, oh, I did it yesterday. I don't have to do it again today. It's true, you don't have to stay up all night on the second night of Shavuos. There's no such minog. But it's a day. It's a day in which we devote ourselves to thinking about uh, what HaKadosh Baruch Hu wants of us and what we might be able to do to enhance that. And certainly, uh, certainly you, should, uh, you, should learn, um, you should learn Torah on that day. Uh, some people said that it was a great opportunity to learn Hilchot Talmud Torah the laws of Talmud Torah that the Rambam sets down, since the night before was Kabbalah Satara, and the implication of Kabbalah Satara is, after all, Talmud Torah, so that you should you learn whatever it is you're accustomed to learning on Yantiv, but you could add to that Hilchas Talmud Torah, Hilchas Talmud Torah, which is also in Yano Shalyom. It's the topic of the day. It's what we are... Uh, we're involved with. The Chida, the Chida said that it's important on that day also to do Chidushim, to novel, novel to, to say things that you've never heard before, that you've never thought of before. And while there's a certain danger in this, not everybody is, uh, is disciplined enough to say things that are new and different, nevertheless, the newness itself of the, of the words that you say are very important. Uh, they, they give you entree into a different level of acceptance of the Torah. It's not just, here's the Torah and you have to just sort of keep trying to learn it over and over again. But you are actually involved, involved in the creation of the Torah, so to speak. And that's a special feeling that should be engendered on the second day of Shavuos for those of you in Chutz Laaretz. And that's what the Chida directed us to do. Chidushim of Torah. Not just to learn Torah, not just to memorize, to review, but to actually create certain novel uh, interpretations and ideas that you've never heard before about the, about the Torah.